Hi, my name is Orsus Kind from the Simplify product team. And in this short video, I'll present the environment's changes we've made in 5.5 version. The goal of these changes is to make sure our users really understand the way that our multi-tenancy capabilities work and that they are getting the most out of those capabilities. At the same time, making sure that only the right users can perform more sensitive cross-system actions. Before we start, I would like to clear up a false belief. Multi-tenancy capabilities are not only relevant to MSSPs. Those capabilities are relevant and sometimes even crucial for a large portion of our enterprise customers. The changes we've done are divided into two parts, which we will drill down into in a few seconds. The first one, is changing the confusing concept of no environment to a standard out of the box environment called default environment. The second change is the all environments alignment that makes sure that configurations for all the environments within the system at once will be permitted only to those people that are responsible for this. So let's dive in. The new default environment will be the only environment provided with the system upon installation. Unlike the previous concept of no environment, the default environment will be a standard environment just like any other environment. You can find it in the environment screen, manage this environment's permissions, create dynamic parameters, and everything you can do with any other environment in the system. Regarding migration, in case of an upgrade, all cases, data, and configurations for no environment will be automatically migrated into default environment. It's important to mention here that for any customer with a single environment, this will not make any significant changes in the workflows. All environments means configuration for all environments. For example, configuring a playbook to all environments means that this playbook will be running on every single environment in the system, including new environments that will be added in the future. Select all means that you can configure to all the current environments in the system without including any future environments. This option depends on the specific user's permission, of course. Now about the changes. The most substantial change is that all environments is now managed in the permission groups. The Simplify best practice is to enable this permission only to the few people in the SOC whose job is to manage Simplify and can really understand the meaning of cross-system configuration. Users without all environments permission will not see the all environments option at all. An important note here, users who have all environments permissions will automatically see cases and data from all the environments in the system, including future environments, of course. While upgrading to 5.5 version, the only permission group that automatically gets all environments permissions will be admins. All other groups can manually get this permission, of course. In addition, we've added multiple selection for environments when relevant. For example, it is now possible to configure a playbook for a few environments and not only a single environment or for all environments. As mentioned, all users will have an option to easily select all the environments that they have permissions to within one click using the select all button. Last thing, as part of this alignment, we've closed many bugs, unexpected behaviors and other issues raised by many of our customers. Thank you very much for watching and hope you will enjoy this new version. For any questions or feedback, please don't hesitate to reach out.